we're talking about, for the most part, people in the science community who would not share a moral world view. It would be more of a Darwinian um, survival of the fittest. And ultimately what that can wind up doing is lead to eugenics, that um, if we can improve the human species, we owe it to ourselves to improve the human species. And, but ultimately that creates a have and have not kind of community so that you have some that have the privileges of being able to afford enhancement, others who can't afford enhancement. And so you have a worker class, you know, worker bees, and then you have the privileged communities and it starts developing a lot of different kinds of issues like you saw in World War II with Nazi Germany. They, had, they, they took the whole idea of eugenics to its ultimate um, belief system and started selectively persecuting the Jews because they considered them to be of an inferior blood stock. Uh, and they had the idea they were going to create the Aryan super race, the Ubermenschen that Nietzsche, the uh, German philosopher, had dreamed of, which would become Superman. In fact, the Ubermenschen is where we get the modern term, Superman. Uh, but now we're back, and imagine if Hitler had had the sciences at his disposal that we have today, uh, a madman like him. I'm not sure there's a definite point where we can say, okay, now we're officially transhuman, but I think that by altering our own DNA, we're a step closer. Nobody can stop transhumanism. Transhumanism is going to happen. It's inevitable. It's who we're becoming. What will the cost be? to human society if transhumanist aspirations are reached? Oh, well, there, there are a lot of existential risks involved in transhumanism. I mean, anything from the scenario of a bunch of killer robots to the idea of altering our own genetics in a way where we become like these Nazi supermen, which is pretty scary. I think the cost is that people are gonna lose what they consider their humanity. And like, even though we're gonna become hyper and meta-human, a lot of people are gonna feel that we've lost what they are, that they've lost their identities, that they've lost just their, their human conception, their, their human essence. And I think that's gonna be a big deal for a lot of people. Well, I'm, I'm very concerned about what that cost will be, and I'm not alone. Um, some of the brightest minds on Earth right now are concerned about what that might be. Uh, Professor uh, Francis Fukuyama, who is a celebrated um, intellectual, said that he thinks that it is the most dangerous idea in the history of mankind. And he believes that it could lead to an extinction level event that would wipe out all of humanity. Unintended consequences. 